world's largest science experiment has achieved another milestone, finding a new state of matter called a pentaquark. The existence of pentaquarks have been predicted for more than 50 years, but they have never before been observed experimentally. The person who made the prediction, Murray Gell-Mann, changed our understanding of the structure of matter and won the 1969 Nobel Prize for Physics. Many particle physics experiments since the 1990s have claimed to have seen pentaquarks, but their claims could not have replicated or verified. The new results from the Large Hadron Collider at Geneva yet to be peer-reviewed are the most promising since it restarted earlier in 2015 after an upgrade. It has been able to produce double the collision energy, allowing scientists to observe phenomena that they had never seen before. A pentaquark, as the name suggests, is made up of five quarks. The environment under which this exotic particle can be found in supernova when a star explodes and releases all of its energy in one moment rather than over a lifetime of billions of years. Scientists admit that they weren't specifically looking for pentaquarks, but they reached the conclusion of its existence by excluding all of the possibilities. Now that the LHC scientists have found one type of pentaquark, they are bound to find others. When they do, the findings will help them refine their understanding of what happens in these spectacular explosions occurring frequently in the universe all the while sitting in an armchair in an underground man-made cave in Switzerland. We've achieved a historic first. The United States is first, the first nation, nation to reach Pluto. And with this mission, we, will have, visited every, we have visited every single planet in our solar system.